Uh, Mike, I think you're going yeah. to be jealous now when you see what I'm in. Check oh, yeah? This, but yes. I am in a Tesla 2012 all electric, red. It's beautiful. I'm here with Dave Stahl. Good morning, Dave. How red could it get? Here, let me get here down here with you. Well, you know, this car, I have to say, right out of the box, when it comes to electric automobiles, and uh -huh. I've driven all of them from the EV1 to the Leaf to the Mitsubishi, and I've driven them all, this car is the future of electric vehicles. Oh, it's beautiful. This is this thing, the first sports? Would you? It, yeah, this would be considered, that they built us in 08. It started okay. in 08, so they had their real you know, out of the box thinking people. They took a beautiful car, the Lotus Aurora, to, to put their electric uh, engine in. Uh -huh. And when you stop and think about it, what else would they put it in of this size? Now, this car's probably not for everybody. If you're not a real big sports car enthusiast, you know, then this may not be something that you'd be interested in. Right. If there was a negative, the price is a little a bit uh, out, of, <laughs> out of the ballpark. But once the technology gets down the road and these cars, they've got, these folks have got a car coming out that's gonna run 50K. Oh, really? Still pricey. But eventually, but. the other thing is, these guys beat the range uh, uh, war over everybody. Okay. You've got over 200 mile range in this car, depending on the road conditions, hills and what have you. Yes. And they took one of these and got over 300 in Germany. Oh my word. So this is, I think, the future. People say, mm -hmm. well, how far can I go? How far can I go? Mm -hmm. Well, it depends on what your lifestyles are. Right. This car, it's fun to drive. Okay, it doesn't have power steering, which it probably could have, you know, when you're doing real slow driving and you'll notice it when you leave. Okay. But one of the things it has it does, it, it is stupid fast. Okay, David wants to know how, how fast can it go in, you know, one point two seconds. Not, oh, in zero to sixty, it's right around three nine four two, somewhere in that area. Okay. 3.9 seconds. Oh my word. Four two seconds. Okay. <laughs> so don't blink. Yeah, and, and you know, and there's a lot more under the hood, but they just have it governed to, to, to this, so the drivetrain stays intact. Okay. But you know, it's it's everything you would want in an electric car if you want to have fun. I mean, I've been having a blast. I have the top down. Oh, I bet. Now the top is very easy to take off and put back we on. We were watching you earlier. Yeah, so it's just a matter of a so couple of pins and, okay. and off it goes. It fits in the trunk. Okay. Uh, we're going to leave you in this just because. And the interior is beautiful. Yeah, we, it's it's very nice. They've done a nice job. These are the upgraded seats that they put in it. They've got the Tesla's logos in it. We can just kind of, one of the reasons that you, you might want to think about getting it out is this big sill here. Right. Well, there's a lot of safety involved in that, and that you know, since this is such a small car. Uh -huh. And that is something people are concerned about is, sure. is what's the safety like? Sure. These things pass all the safety tests. Okay. In fact, I think with the battery, I don't have the numbers, but I think it's a little heavier than the normal stock Lotus. So, you know, it kind of plants itself to the ground. Right, low and heavy. But you really look good in this thing. Is it me, it's do you, you think? Okay, but everyone wants to know the price. Yes. Okay, well, you they start out right around 102 to 110,000. This is the 2.5 with a lot of bells and whistles on it. Okay. Touches out at a 152, 645. Yeah. But there's government, you know, rebates on these things. Okay. So if a person has a wear for all, this is probably something that they want to have in their garage to go to and from work or if they're just putzing around, you know. And when you, you know, think about how much you're saving in gas, oh, you won't pay there a dime. You go. And if you put and you put it on a 220, it only charge it takes only three and a half hours. But it gave me over 200 miles range. I went to La Mesa car show with this thing last uh -huh. night. I was all over the place uh -huh. with it. And and all that anxiety was totally, totally gone. Right. Let's do it real quick and show you how they plug okay. it in. Simple, simple, simple. You can just stay right there. This thing comes up. It's got a little white line. Very important. You push this right in here, turn it. And bingo, I think somebody unplugged me on the back. Yeah. And then, boom, that's all you do. Oh, you got to take now, the key is out. Now, what's the beeping noise? You have to turn oh, the key off. okay. Because, yeah, go ahead and pull the key out. There we go. Yeah, because see, it was mad there at us because are. we had the key in. See, okay, it's a smart so car. it warns you, it tells you. Oh, the other thing the guy told me, too, just so you, when you decide to drive away, yes. they have a way of going in this car to see if you abused it or not. So you have to be oh, nice. Oh, are, yeah. are you sure you trust me? Then? No, I don't know. This thing, will tell, <laughs> this thing will tell a story. All right. You're all right go. How do I drive this baby? Well, all you do is you start, put your foot on the brake, turn okay. the key all the way over, and wait for a little tongue. Okay. Ah, Ooh, doo -doo. Drop the emergency brake. Drop the emergency brake. I expect a voice to talk yeah, to I know. me. This Push thing is D so beautiful. Push D for uh, David. Or D for drive. David. And let your foot off the brake. Listen to this. You can't and even hear it. See ya. All Hit right. I'm Hit out of here. I don't even have my seatbelt on. Bye, everyone. See you later. We'll be right back. Traffic. I'm not coming back, though. Woo!